Leave your marks and memes about Lego And I'll rate them all in the next episode of What, what even is that? Hello! You know what time it is. We're looking at the subreddit. And today, let's see, we'll start with the top of the week. Or hot of the week. Dang it, I was so close to making that perfect. Sam Lee, one year tribute. Man, it's been a year. Well, rest in peace. Excelsior. That was by Eat Yourself Off a Cliff. <laughs> it's funny, he's like, Stan Lee, one year tribute. <laughs> Eat yourself right off a cliff. <laughs> Anyways. Creep Pig. Oh, man. Dead meme. Oh, man. That's by Adritruji. Hope I said that right. Buckle up. This one's a crap post by Beaches. Because of recent updates with YouTube, content aimed at children will have many features disabled to them, including comments. While I never saw my channel as a kid's channel, rather a channel for anyone, I will have to start dropping swear words in my videos to ensure that you guys can still be a community. Yeah, I did post this, and here's the thing. A lot of my videos today were a hit, and, and I'm saying this on Wednesday, that's when I'm recording it, or no, actually technically Tuesday. You get the point. But they had this announcement, and basically, they're deeming certain channels as kids' channels, and if they deem that channel as a kids' channel, no videos on that channel can have comments, can have personalized ad, which I don't know what's the difference between regular ads and personalized ads, I probably should, because that's my livelihood. And then also, there's a feature to, I think even removes the end screen or something like that. Like, why would you remove the end screen? Like, wh is that luring kids somewhere? I don't know. But at the end of the day, if they deem my channel a kid's channel, I'm screwed. <laughs> you guys can't be able to comment on videos, which I think is so stupid. But they've already hit some of my videos that I've released recently as kids approved or something, which means they're gonna have limited ads, so I won't make as much money on them. Nobody could comment anymore, and I think by that extension, they're gonna remove all the old comments, so if this is like a really important video or anything, well, you can't see the history of the comments, so that's great. And it's just ridiculous. I, I'm sure the government or whatever is making them crack down on this, but there has to be a better way, okay? I, I hate, when it's ever, it's YouTube automatedly trying to figure something up, like how they just marked a bunch of my channel or a bunch of my videos as kids videos or whatever, it, they always screw something up. Like, for example, they're forcing us even to see which ones of our videos are marked up. They're forcing us to use the crappy, it's a terrible, terrible new video manager section. YouTube Studio, this is just, it's, it's awful. It's slow to navigate. It's more confusing than it was before. It takes more steps to do things. And it's just annoying. It makes me not want to upload stuff as a content creator. Anyways, it's just, I don't get why. It, 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 this is just something that's always been consistent with YouTube. They always make terrible updates. Like, I don't get why we're still in this. Because it seemed like YouTube was doing good for a while. Now, well, some of my videos are kids' videos. Some of them aren't. I don't, it, it just ticks me off. YouTube rent over. Let's go to Reddit. <laughs> All right, I probably will need to uh, cut that down a bit. <laughs> Who knows? Or maybe it'll just get the whole thing. Ferb has seen all, so <laughs> thank you. <laughs> That's from our newest CMF draft. Uh, we did Phineas and Ferb. Damn ass hell will evolve. So there you go, another one about my post on that. You guys now know my two cents. Lego is life and love 56. Also, I have to say, those that whole rant was unscripted, so I'm sure I made a couple mistakes, all right? But uh, it's it's something that means a lot to me. And, ah, oh, rest in peace. This is a really cool mock, though. Nintendo memes and more. All right, we'll do these last two for the hot and go on to just the top of the week. Beaches, after I tell him that we need to do a second crossover meme since Justin missed out on our first one. I'm sorry. I, I, I think I saw it somewhere on Instagram or something. I don't know. Uh, but that was by Beaches. After Justin found out about the new 2020... <laughs> I'm gonna have to swear, damn ass hell, you could not live with your own failure. Where did that bring you? Back to me. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> then I ran my mouth on Twitter like I usually do. Which, if you want the raw J2G things, I think less tw less times do I think twice about my posts on Twitter than I think about my posts on YouTube. So there you go. But uh, let's see the top this past week. Maximum security. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> that's funny. Lego Man 7. King Dice. Ooh, that's a sweet custom. Great idea to use like a Minecraft face. That's a really good one, Russian Batman. Uh, 
I made something. <laughs> Free time, school, mom, and me. We already did this one, didn't we? I don't remember. It looks familiar though, so sorry, Oscapil37, or did you just get featured twice? Ooh. These are confusing times. Pretzel Girl and Pretzel Girl. Yeah, I know there's two imposters. I don't know which is which. I don't know. I, my mind's set on the Chinese New Year set. Get it? Set on. This is getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. That's pretty funny. Uh, me explaining to my mom why dad and I bought that $300 Lego set. <laughs> I like how the mom is Pennywise. It's just a, a clown family. <laughs> and you're a part of it. Jackson Tump, that's pretty funny. 7 out of 10. Top 10 anime crossovers. Oh my gosh. I Okay, the Lego role players in my... <laughs> the Lego role players in my comment section, it's getting kind of like... I'm sorry, it's getting... It's getting funny, okay? But like... It, it just cool down, okay? I saw there's like a Lucy, there's, a, there's an Emmett. <laughs> we got these three. <laughs> just, just cool down a bit. <laughs> I don't want this to be categorized as spam, you know, if it gets too redundant. But that was Spider Rider. <laughs> this is funny stuff. Wow, they they like twins. <laughs> but like, look like, I think that's a crap post, but thank you. Yeah, I mean, I always thought that was based off Steven Spielberg, but that was actually produced in 1999. So studios were just produced in 2001. And I guess, was it 2000? Well, definitely 2001. So yeah, this was actually appeared before that, so. There's something. Dutcheries. Michael Keaton, Batman. Oh, nice. Yeah, uh, that's the, the big ga gap between them. That was, I don't know what I was trying to enunciate there. I was like, gah, gah, gah. But I thought you were going to do like a little edit, you know, like uh, the eyes or something like that. Because I know Ashton did a really cool edit of that. Just Two Mom. Yeah, Just Two Mom has a YouTube channel, so go check her out. Look at that. Are we blind? Deploy the subscribers. <laughs> Hopefully she doesn't get uh, nixed as a kids channel because that would suck. She's loving your guys' comments, so keep it up. Poor pretzel woman, just a good Chinese New Year set. Aww, aww. Yeah, well, yeah. There's, there's so much you guys don't even know about Patricia Pretzel Girl. That's for another day. But that's by one two three. Bread is good. All right. Why do you think <laughs> Destiny's Bounty just a <laughs> <laughs> That's an old meme, bro. And my phone just went off. Sorry. All I have now are dog trainer hair pieces. Lego new hair piece. Da -na -na -na. <laughs> that was by Dylan Wingle, and this one was by the Triggered Asian. So there you go. Thought we wouldn't notice, but we did. Clever girl. <laughs> exactly. All right. You guys always post reflections. There you go. Okay. You can see I'm clearly an insect, and this disregards any previous reflection ever. All right, so it's over, guys. You guys are obliterated. That's by X8 Int Spider Man <laughs> King Shark. All right, let's see King Shark. Oh shoot, that's pretty dope. I like how you used the old. That's the older, no, 2009 one, because they hadn't. They have that newer one with the fins, or sorry, the gills. But uh, yeah, that's the one that I remember I got from the Destiny's Bounty set. And I guess it was in 2008 too because it was in Agents. But that's pretty dope, Gorilla Guy. Let's see. He is inevitable. Nobody. Lego Mission X's profile picture. <laughs> that's a crap post, Wombat Boy. That's a crap post. Bat Cave Mini Mock for animation I'm doing. Also lighting test. Oh, I, I, first off, I really like your lighting. It has almost like a gradient type of feel to it. And the Batcave Mini Mock is pretty adorable. So good job, Spider Rider. That's another one by you. Let's see. I made an Android with a gun. What could you, what more could you want? Oh, that is kind of cool. Crusty Mongrel. Uh, I love that. Uh, studs on top techniques for the head right there. That's pretty dope. Just too good with that iPhone 11. I do have an iPhone 11. <laughs> I usually just get the newest iPhone. I know, it's call me an Apple sheep, but it's just like, well, the last version was consistently good for me, so I might as well just get the new version because there's a newer camera. And then you'll be like, oh, well, I guess you waste your money. And then I'm like, well, that's my money. Why are you deciding what I can do with my money? Anyway, it's a bit late, but I made a werewolf. Happy late Halloween. Well, it is a bit late, but it's still pretty cool, Krusty Mongrel. And pretzel girls, too. When your mother asks you why you are watching a person in a mantis mask review memes about Mary, like I said, you wouldn't get it. <laughs> That's good, Pangolin Yeet. Uh, 7 out of 10. Hey, Peter! 
I love it. That's amazing original voice. Great stuff. Great content. First post found this in Discord. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, I think I saw that. Did I see that on uh, Reddit or something? I don't know. But that's by Hicks3333. And just too good wedding stop motion. Oh, Purish is in here. Look at that. Oh, wow. You even got MNR. Ash and Flash. Just too mom. Chinese New Year said, take just too good to be your lawfully wedded husband. I do. I pronounce you husband <laughs> and Seth. Uh, <laughs> that was dope. Is that Pierce's voice? That's the first time I'm hearing his voice, but <laughs> that was dope. I love it. And I don't have the antennas there because, you know, I slicked them down. It's a special occasion. Don't want those poking out. <laughs> I love that. That was awesome. That was that's my favorite one of the, the favorite posts of the week. When your mom forces you to bring your little brother to work. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, that's pretty funny. All right, all right. Let's do some fan art. Fan art. Come on. Where is the fan art? Come on. Okay. I'm new here, but I hope this makes it in. J2G, Pretzel Girl, Ash and Flash. We saw this last week, but it made it in twice, so there you go. Mandalorian parody sneak peek. Boba is mad that Disney replaced him with the, the Mandalorian. <laughs> I thought I was reading it wrong. I'm like, oh. But uh, Absolutely Studios, I love that. <laughs> That's a good gif in general, so good stuff. Uh, custom Torso at Disney Springs. Oh, look at that. That's actually a really good drawing of Mickey, that you did on that little screen that screen's a pain in the butt to draw with uh, miss snacks three i tried my best let's see oh look at that that's some really dope art all right that one guy one two one yt let's see if it shows up on his ripoff show because you know mine came first obviously looking at the hot section on our just too good should be limited to five minutes when doing osrs especially given that to get on from there you just have to post at the right time not post actual good content that gets on top sounds like lego machine x he's, he's he's triggered it's like hashtag machine x triggered that he doesn't get featured enough no i'm kidding actually i didn't know that was a problem until now when you guys make posts like this it makes me aware of problems i wasn't even aware of so if you ever have like a complaint on your channel do it not under fan art okay but then again ooh, i wouldn't have seen this if it wasn't under fan art all right just make a community organization around it. You know, be like, hey, everybody upvote this post or something. And then I could check it out. Cause like, I don't know the complaints. I read the comments, but most of the comments I see are the top comments, you know? And then most of the new comments are spam. <laughs> so it's hard to really sift through, but this is a good way to say, hey, this is something that's up. Honestly though, I think we should just add a complaints tab. That could be something that I could check every week and then address your complaints. Okay, I'm looking where that's going. I wouldn't get purish on that. <laughs> So thank you very much, Lego Mission X. That actually was very helpful. He is a mantis. Stop denying it. It's not a mask. See, not a mask. Exactly. That's how I feel, JB YouTube. You understand me. Thank you. All right, one more. Oh, we already saw that. One more. Just to doodle. I was supposed to be doing homework. Aw, that's a cute little doodle. Thank you, the nest builder. Well, for that, let's do another one. This piece just came in the Palace Cinema set. Oh, that's something I do gotta check. All right, Lego Mission X. Seriously, stop mislabeling as fan art, okay? This is helpful, but like, you don't need to label it as fan art, okay? Please stop doing that. That's your first warning. Are just too good. Again, seriously, Pretzel, Igor, Fireman, Chima Ghost. Alright, this is all. Okay, I, I want to get a little bit more fan art, but people are labeling memes under fan art, so there you go, Universe Sheep. Anyways, though, that was a very insightful episode. You know, we got to the problems, and hopefully, you know, with our voices, we could show YouTube that, hey, a comment section is something that channels that are marked for everybody should have. I don't know. They should just make a marking for everybody. I know on the little page or whatever, they're like, hey, if you are a channel for everybody, just see if your content applies to the children rules or whatever. But then that means that there are times when they can mark our content. And I don't like YouTube marking my content because I'm sorry. My stuff is appropriate for kids, but people of all ages enjoys it. So no reason to take away the comments. I'm just rambling on at this point. I'm, see, I got mad in the middle, and I got mad at the end. And it's not your guys' fault. It's YouTube. Like, why? But at the end of the day, I'm fortunate to have a job like this. So 
I can't take it too seriously. But then again, I do take it seriously because it's something I'm so proud to have. I, seeing all of your guys' support just makes me want to do my best, you know? Anyways, now I'm really rambling, but that's it for now. I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.